what I'm really looking for is some way of, of cutting our gas bill, because that's the horrendous thing at the moment. Fuel prices are not going to go down. They're going to steeply rise as our resources run out. And so the actual cost is going to be offset more quickly than I think um, they're currently estimating. The air to air heat pumps sort of met the bill. Um, they do provide a, a dramatic reduction in, in carbon footprint and at the same time provide a good and controllable source of heat when you want it. It does what it says on the tin. The house is lovely and warm, much warmer than it was in my central heating days when I was running entirely on a gas central heating. So from a comfort point of view, all through the day it is much better. Well in the last say four years mine has almost doubled my gas costs. So another motivation for thinking seriously about installing this. But I know that the central heating hasn't been on, so there must be a reduction on what I was burning last year. When this, this air to air was demonstrated, I felt immediately that Frank would benefit from it, and he has. Pretty better, less pain to my chest. Our direct debit was £98 a month. Uh, and it's now, <laughs> they, uh, I just read the meters today and sent them a, an email and they've come back and said, as of next month we're reducing your direct debit to £65.40. Mm. The warmth that we have experienced has been better during the day when we didn't have the central heating running, so we've had a warm house during the day and there is without doubt a major reduction in the need for my gas central heating. It's done everything we wanted plus a bit. We didn't expect the health benefits so much no. as it has been, been very pronounced, you know. Definitely. I've had it running since Christmas. I'm 23, turned to there, and my central heating has not come on. And we have been entirely comfortable. I only take 50% of the medication that I had before to control, just to control emphysema. And I have a bit more energy to be able to go in the garden. Took me most of my energy just to breathe. Well, the other thing that, that impressed me was the fact it was uh, uh, Worcester Bosch. Yes. Um, we, we've had mm. good experience with their products, haven't we? Mm. We've got a dishwasher and a boiler. When we take the filter out, I can see what's accumulated on the filter. I do know that that would have gone into my lungs. Mm. It's obvious I'm not putting moisture into my lungs, I'm not putting dust Sorry. into my lungs. It's our primary source of heating downstairs now, and we haven't really noticed a big increase in electricity costs. It hasn't happened. One thing we have noticed, though, of course, is that we've used significantly less oil this winter than we would have done on a previous winter. It's comfortable. I just have it ticking over, and it keeps the bungalow warm all the way through. My heating bill is going to be a fraction of the cost, and also, I can afford to heat all the bungalow. Before we had this uh, system, we had the radiator, the long radiator, and it was about 10 foot long. And when it was cold, we had to close the conservatory doors so the cold didn't go into the house. But now, we leave the doors open and the, the warm air just drifts into here. I've got it in the conservatory and I find it far much much warmer out there which I can go in and out and it keeps the kitchen and all the back of the bungalow very warm. Um, I never actually use a conservatory in the winter. Since I've had that you know I find it I can sit at the table out there and I've done all my Christmas cards everything out there this year. A bungalow is nice and warm all the time now. A 26 by 8 foot conservatory two bedrooms, a big kitchen and the living room. Having the heat pump going on low, it keeps the house just under 70, 24-7. The even air and the clean air, no moisture air, is, you know, logically benefit to my chest and so mm. my breathing and my general health. Mm. This one, the balloon, used to snore something terrible. The noise was horrendous, but since I've had the air eating, it's virtually stopped. It does um, 
She does breathe a lot better. All of them, I think, breathe a lot better. Because with the cat hairs and stuff, and I've got asthma. I, um, I haven't used an asthma inhaler since I've had it in there. Very good. Um, over this rather cold winter we've just been through, we have used our oil fired central heating in the, on the ground floor very very little only on the the coldest days you know when we had temperatures outside of minus nine then yes we did use our oil boiler to to warm the downstairs but on days when we've just got a mere minus five the air to air heat pumps have done the job perfectly well helped me big time uh with the little pension i'm on otherwise i, I wouldn't be able to heat the whole place and um be able to stay, I would have to find a smaller place. I find it's absolutely excellent.